You are listening to Results Over BS. You're about to find out the secrets to building a wildly profitable online business without the confusion or overwhelm so you can finally have the lifestyle of freedom you've always wanted. Markwell Russell is internationally known for helping his clients turn their passions, knowledge, and expertise into premium price programs that bring in tens of thousands of dollars each month. Here's Markwell. Hey, what's up, my friend? Markwell Russell here, and welcome to today's episode of Results Over BS. And you're going to absolutely love today's episode, and here's why. So I'm literally about to share with you seven things that I teach my clients about building a six- or seven-figure online business, okay? Seven things that I teach my clients about building a six- or seven-figure online business. Now, if you're not desiring to build a six- or seven-figure online business, and you just want to get to the point where you're just making enough money to quit your job, whether that's $2,000, $5,000 a month or whatever, these same strategies work for you as well. But if you want to get to six- or seven-figures, these same strategies apply, okay? And I'm going to break these down to you. I I, I literally, so I did a a mastermind live with my clients a few months ago, and this is really what we dove into behind the scenes. Individuals who paid me tens of thousands of dollars. This is what we talked about at this particular live mastermind. And I'm going to share this with you. And if you're not applying this into your business, you're probably leaving a lot of money on the table, okay? You're probably not making the money that you want to make. So I'm really going to, you know, share it with you today. So I hope you're ready to take notes and you're definitely going to want to probably listen to this episode a few times. And um, you're going to love this one because just this alone could easily be sold for $997. There's a lot of the gurus out there sell this type of stuff for $997 or even more, but I'm going to give it to you because if I knew this five or six years ago, we'd be way, way further than we are now. But no regrets, right? And of course, be sure that you go to yourpotgift.com and make sure you get your free bundle. Well, I'm going to share with you how I built my online business in six figures in six months, how I do Facebook ads to get high quality clients. This is the type of stuff that I share with my clients. You're going to actually get access to this right now and a lot of other cool bonuses as well. And this is free, yourpotgift.com. All you got to do is go over and get access to it for free. Nothing to buy, no strings attached. It's just my gift for saying thank you for checking out our show, okay? So let's go ahead and dive into it. And I want to really keep this straight to the point. And I promise you, I'll keep these episodes tight, okay? And of course, if you haven't listened to our introductory episode, make sure you do that so you can make sure that you have an idea of where we're going with the show and if it's going to be a good fit for you, okay? So let's go ahead and dive in. So seven things I teach my clients about building a six or seven figure online business, okay? And this helped me go from struggling to rapidly going our business to over the $100,000 per month mark, helping clients, you know, do the same exact thing. I have clients that are using these strategies that are making $5,000 a month now or individuals who are making over $50,000 a month. So it absolutely worked for you, all right? So let's go ahead and get into it. So number one, seven things. Number one, and this is a process, step by step. Number one, you have to get crystal clear on your target audience. So who are you meant to serve? With what you have, or who are you desiring to serve? You want to get crystal clear on your target audience. A lot of people say things like, Well, anybody can buy my product and all this different type of stuff. And typically, people who say that type of stuff are broke. They're not making the money they want to make. They're confused, they're overwhelmed, they're all over the place because they're not crystal clear on who they're targeting. Okay. So let's say, for example, they're selling a fitness product. They're saying, Well, everybody can stand to lose a couple pounds, so everybody can use it. Okay, even if that may be true, but why not be selling to people who are already looking for fitness products? Or why not be selling to people who already have bought fitness products? Wouldn't that make way more sense? So get crystal clear on your target audience. So I speak to people in network marketing all the time, and they're out trying to pitch people who aren't interested in having a business. The ideal client for somebody who's in network marketing are people who have bought into other network marketing type of things, right? If you're selling, you know, dating advice, you're selling it to people who are already bought dating advice. So you, does that make sense? So you want to get crystal clear on who is your target audience. You don't have to convince these people to buy from you. They're already ready to buy. They're just looking for what you have to offer. So that's number one, your target audience. Number two, you want to create a high ticket offer. Now, a lot of times people on online, they're telling you that you got to sell something for $7 and then upsell them to $97 and then upsell them to $297 and then all the different type of stuff and then have a high ticket back end on the back end, the $5,000, $10,000 program. What I found is that people, they just want a result. They just want an outcome. And they would rather, instead of you penny pinch them, taking them through the Ascension model, they'd rather you just offer them your primary high ticket offer from the beginning and just get straight to the point. If it's going to cost them $1,000 or $5,000 or $10,000, you know, just let them know that up front instead of trying to sell them all this low-end BS stuff to kind of lead them to something else because people want the 
real deal. Okay. So when you offer people a high ticket offer, right? It helps both of you. It helps, number one, them because they're going to be way more committed than versus buying something for $7. If they buy it for $7,000, they're going to be way more committed. Also, you're going to hit your income goals way, way faster because it's way easier to hit your income goals in $2,000 chunks than $200 chunks or even $20 chunks, okay? So you want to have a high ticket offer. Number three is you want to put a funnel together. I call this an ultimate online marketing machine. So this is where you give away something free, whether that's a webinar, whether that's a training video or whatever, and then you take them through a process where you educate them, right, on you and what you have to offer, and then you give them an opportunity to buy or get on the phone with you or whatever your sales mechanism is going to be, okay? So that's number three. Number four is traffic. Now you want to start driving traffic. Now, the big mistake that a lot of people make online is they go out and try to start learning all these traffic strategies when in reality, you don't have to do all of that stuff. If you pick one traffic strategy, one traffic strategy, that's enough to get you to six figures. That's really enough to get you to seven figures, right? Or that's definitely enough to get you full-time in your online business if you're not full-time yet. Just pick one. I guarantee if you just pick one traffic strategy, whether that's Facebook ads, whether that's YouTube, whether that's whatever, and you focus on that for the next 90 days, nothing else, you start getting results, right? And then you can start other adding other strategies if you want, but you will find out that you really don't have to because there's masses of people out there on these one particular platform. So pick you one strategy and just go all in on it and stop watching webinars and all this other type of stuff that's not related to that particular strategy, okay? Number Five, because number one was target audience. Number two was high ticket offer. Number three was funnel, ultimate online marketing machine, which I like to call it. Number four is traffic. Number five, we like to do an enrollment call because when you're selling a high ticket offer, this is anywhere from $3,000 to $10,000 or beyond, you actually want to get them on the phone and that's where you make them the offer because you your closing rate will go up big time because online, a high conversion rate on the sales page is like 3%. Right. But if you get some out on the phone, you can actually close at 20 to 25 percent. OK, so it's really, really good if you get them on the phone and then you take them through a process. Now, you don't have to be like a go into real slimy salesman mode on the phone. You're basically doing one thing. You're diagnosing their problem, seeing where they are. Number one. Right. It's simple. You're seeing where they are. It's a three pillar process when doing this enrollment call. Number one, you're seeing where they are currently. Number two, you're seeing where they desire to be. So their current reality and their preferred reality, right? And then you're showing them that gap. You're helping them realize that there's a gap there, right? And then you're letting them know that what you offer is the thing that closes that gap. Nothing else. Only what you offer is the thing that's going to help them close that gap from where they are to where they want to be, okay? And that's kind of the psychology of the enrollment call. Number six is the fulfillment. How do you deliver your program? You know, are you doing a done-for-you type of service? Are you doing group coaching? How are you fulfilling what you have to offer? And number seven, this is where we scale. So this is how we go from 1000 a month to 10000 a month, from 10000 a month to 20000 a month, 30000 a month. So this comes in a place where you're hiring people, right? So you're at a point where you want to bring on some virtual assistants or you want to bring on some interns or you want to outsource other things that you have to do and you start focusing on just the one thing that you want to do and then you can outsource the other stuff to other people and you can focus on just your high leverage area, right? Instead of kind of being all over the place, trying to do everything, being a busy fool, as one of my buddies and mentors says, you just want to focus on just your area of expertise, what you enjoy doing, and then you outsource the rest, okay? So that's the seven things that I teach my clients about building a six or seven figure online business. So number one is a target audience. Number two is the high ticket offer. Number three is your ultimate online market machine, aka your funnel. Number four is traffic. Number five is your enrollment call. Number six is fulfillment. And number seven is scaling, okay? So hopefully you got some value from today's episode. My friend, leave us a five-star rating review if you got value. Let us know in the comment section. Of course, reach out if you have any questions and be sure to get your free bundle gift at yourpodgift.com. That's Y-O-U-R-P-O-D-G-I-F-T.com. Get access to your gift and leave us a five-star rating review. Share this around. Subscribe to the show most importantly, because you definitely don't want to miss out on any other upcoming episodes, okay? And of course, if you want the show notes, go over to marquellrussell.com. That's M-A-R-Q-U-E-L-R-U-S-S-E-L-L.com. And you just click podcast and scroll down and you can see the show notes and other episodes, all right? So that's it for today's episode, my friend. Thank you so much for being here and I'll see you in the next episode. 